Hello and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to some more Seven Days to Die Zero Crafting series where I'm going to quickly run to the trader before he closes and then run back. And then we have to find some place that has cobblestone because we finally managed to find a shovel. So we can actually start digging up cobblestone and make a base and cement. Actually not cement so much because we can't craft it. But cobblestone so that we can actually make something that will defend def yes, defend us against the zombies come Horde Nights. Which is only, well it's going to be day 12 so two days away. It's not looking good really. Um, I have literally no idea how I'm going to do this if I'm honest. Um, it's going to be an interesting Horde night again. Hopefully I won't die, but I have a feeling I will. Are you friendly? Oh, here yeah, we want to talk to him. And, okay, let's sell some, some stuff. There we go. Yeah, it feels weird selling all this stuff knowing I can't craft it, but it's fine. Grain alcohol doesn't... Uh, does sell re reasonably well. It sells okay, I guess. And these sell pretty damn good, actually. And I've got a couple of double barrels, so that's fine. Okay, so what have we got? Concrete, that's going to be handy. Uh, got to be quick, so let's go through. Day 13, he restocks, so let's just take a look. Honey. Mm -hmm. Not so bad. You know what? Yeah, let's take it just in case. Um, nine millimeter ammo. No, I think resources would be better at the moment. Nothing there. No. Okay, secret stash. Wow, there's not much here actually. Have I bought some stuff from him? Possibly I have. Okay, well let's buy all of that, and I'm going to start with buying that as well. And so we'll buy the wood, saves us cutting down some trees. I think that's it. Yes. Well, it's about time you bought something. I always buy stuff. What are you want about, maybe? Do I buy stuff? I can't remember. Uh, coffee, tuna, you know what, let's buy some of that, some of that, golden rod tea, okay, and a couple of good juices, right, can't remember if I've got this thing up here, I did, I don't think I've got it in my stream series, I'll have to check that when I next play. So that's done. We got that done in time. Let's uh, see what we need to eat and drink. Uh, it's just food as normal. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's been the longest intro ever. And if you do like it, remember to hit the like button. And if you want to see more videos, remember to hit the subscribe button. But we're going to eat everything we got here because we need the stamina. We're look, doing good on health for once. Which is, a, you know, quite a big shock. But that's fine. But anyway, let's get back to base. Is now and I'll probably hide out until the morning because I'm a coward. Well, I've literally just shit myself. But it's all good, because the zombie's dead. And I don't think I attracted any other zombies, so it's all good. Okay, that's um, okay, I suppose. Let's just uh, carry on cleaning up the place. Uh, someone stepped on a mine by the sounds of things. And the other thing I'm doing is... Wrenching stuff, because... What you get from them, all the electrical parts, electrical components, springs, stuff like that. 
sell reasonably well in bulk. So doing that is not a bad thing. Because this is then passive earnings, basically. And I don't think we can... No, we can't take those apart. I think I've taken everything apart in here. Bookcase, we'll leave. We've got the PC monitor, we're taking that out. Okay. Let's take all these out. Okay, so I have a rough idea of what I want to do. Rough idea, that is. And it basically involves um, using my wood frames. And what can we make? Make half blocks. That would work. And see, that's one way up. But that's the only real way up. Uh, wow. No, that's the that's the actual block, isn't it? Three hundred is the door frame here. That's what we want to get rid of. And for the bottom part. I think I have a door somewhere as well. So I can stick that down here, which will be good. Um, let's get rid of the sofa. I may need to get the wood and the leather sells reasonably well as well in bulk. But I think... I don't know, maybe having a ramp up there is going to be the best bet. I think. And then if I block this off, because the good thing is I can upgrade wood straight through to concrete. It doesn't take too much. There you go. And it gives me a decent amount of XP as well. So let's just wait a second. Clear that. Let that XP clear. And let's see how much XP we get from one upgrade. 48. Again, 48. Quite a bit more. So 456. That's more than a zombie kill. So doing this is going to get me some levels up. Which is handy. So I'm going to leave a doorway for the moment so I can get through, but it will probably disappear in time. So this will then split the base in half. And if I can get lucky at a trader and get some boxes or storage things, I'll buy those and put those upstairs, because the zombies can't get up there at all, which is handy. And there we go, and we've pretty much got the level up now. Getting there. Okay, we probably won't get the level up from doing just these, but we're close. Last run, yeah, it's not going to give me a level up, damn it. But as I said, it's very close. Uh, we won't take those out. Um, the zombies will probably start breaking that down, which is fine. Don't need to worry about anything there. All this is plastic. No, that's concrete, sorry. And we'll leave the light because it's the only source of light down here. So I'll take that for the wood. Two wood better than nothing. This is plastic, I believe. Oh, there's my wrench. Okay, we can't uh, wrench it. Okay, let's change that. That's fine. We can wrench this. Okay, so I've survived the night. 
And this is what I've come up with. Some half blocks stuck together to make it look like it's a full block. And that fits in there not quite nicely. And then I've got this bit around here. I'll break this out in a second. This guy is my test subject who just wandered in. Basically, he doesn't know what to do. So he's hitting random blocks. And in doing so, allows me to just shoot him up the ass. And shoot him however I want, basically. And then I can move around here. If I need to. Okay, so I found some weak points, which is, you know... What we're going to find out on Horde Knight as well. So that is a weak point. Let's... Uh, turn this back to a normal block. And... Pick up my bolts and fix this. So I've still got my hammer on me. I do. So I get these upgraded to concrete, which I've actually got done surprisingly well with. So that's upgraded. That needs scrap. That needs scrap. Okay. And. Yeah, that needs scrap. So all this probably needs to be upgraded as well. Now, downside is, if I fall off, there isn't an easy way for me to get back up. Good news is, I can come over here and shoot out this way as well. Which is good. Good news indeed. Um, what did I want? I wanted uh, scrap. That's not up here. There's only food and medicine up here. Ammos and stuff, and yeah, did I buy? I bought the four x four truck accessories, didn't I? Uh, that may have been a stupid mistake because I can't craft it, can I? Yes, I'm getting mixed up between my um, series. This is this is becoming a problem. I'm forgetting what I can and can't do, and what series I'm playing. Which is fine. It's totally fine. I'm going to make mistakes and I had some rebar frame all night long. Well, let's use it now to upgrade some more blocks or to put some more blocks in at least. Let's uh, put one in here. Yeah. There we go. Lots of XP. And then we can upgrade this one? No, we can't apparently. We can upgrade. Why can't we upgrade this? Because I'm guessing it's a cabinet. Yeah, it's probably a cabinet. So. Uh, what we need to do is place that and that to make sure it doesn't fall down. Don't think it will, but I don't trust the game. Put that in there, upgrade that, and take those out. Okay. And again, stick that in there, upgrade that, upgrade these. Might as well go as, and do as many as I can. I'm only going to do this row because this is the row they're going to be hitting mainly. I will have a level um, block as well. I think this will be the main target. And we've almost, almost got another level up just from upgrading stuff. And yeah, I kind of want to keep them in this area. This is the thing. So maybe put a wall in here. I haven't got the rebar frames to do that, although I would need to put it in all the way down here. Yeah, this will be the one bit I can't really see. Okay, we'll leave that for the moment. We don't really need that now. But I can work with this. I can see changes being made. And is this a countertop? No. It's a full block. Okay, that's good. Because it means I can 
fill in here and upgrade here. I'm going to leave the stools in, the bar stools, because it means there's extra things for them to hit. Same with that and these bits over here, I'm going to leave them in. Hopefully they don't hit my gun saves, but you know, wow, I forgot to, completely forgot to loot that. And that's a good thing. Probably should have just left this in, but never mind. Yeah, I'm going to leave these in. I'm going to take that apart because it gives me electrical parts and stuff. Which again, sell reasonably well. And yes, I can't believe that I bought truck accessories. Never mind. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to head over to the trader and buy the rebar frames that are over there. And we're also going to sell as much junk as we can. Okay, so yeah, it was a bit of a big waste of money me buying the 4x4 of truck accessories. Because, you know, I had a lapse in concentration, people. That's all it is. Never mind. I'm pretty sure everyone in the comment field was going, What the hell are you doing? It's a Nero crafting thing, you can't do anything with that, but hey. Never mind. We all make mistakes. This this series is more of a... Ooh, the, the muzzle breaker. Mm, no, I think we've got other stuff that we can be buying. Uh, lucky goggles. It's one less than what we've already got, so that's fine. Hey, I think... Ammo is a good thing to buy. Yeah. Hey, and we want rebar frames. How many can I now afford? Not too many. I would have. Okay, all of them. Yeah. That's I good. I guess you're not so bad after all. Now we just need to find concrete, ready-made concrete mix, and we're good. And I'm gonna buy some more foods because again, I didn't eat anything or drink anything, which is fine. I'm just used to doing that now. Okay, so food was the big problem, I think. Let's see what drink we're needing. Yeah, that's below 100 as well. So let's eat and drink all this. And then I'm going to head over to the buried treasure site and dig that up. And hopefully we get some good stuff in there. Time to move on. Okay, I get your hints. Goodbye. So the treasure tress isn't too far away. It does mean a little bit of running, unfortunately. But I think we can manage that. So we just have to, for a 4x4 vehicle, we're just going to have to wait till we get them enough money to be able to buy a whole one. Which is what I should have been thinking about, but hey, never mind. Ah, some more food. Well, thanking you. Okay, I found a kitty cat. And... Oh, there we go. I do I have a knife? I don't have a knife on me. Okay, well, let's reload you. And reload you. And we might as well harvest it with our axe. Pretty sure I have a knife back at the base, but there we go. We can sell all of that. Is that a bag? It is a bag. Okay. Cowboy hat. Not so good in the cold biome, but hey. Right, what is my lucky looter at? This is the next question, because otherwise we could be here a while digging this treasure up, and I don't. Are you kidding me? A goddamn bear. Wow. And okay, we're gonna have to deal with the bear, I think. Okay, they're fighting, which is good for me. I 
Okay, I think the zombie's dead. No, the zombie is not dead. But the bear is. And let's take care of you. with his head. Awesome. Oh, what the hell was that? Hang on. Testosterone extract. A compound used to create steroids that is harvested from bears. Oh. That's quite cool. Not that I can actually use it. And it has no sell price. Are you kidding me? That sucks. Okay, so it's going to flash red. No, it doesn't start flashing. It does start red, flashing red. Okay, well, quickly, let's take a look at... Lucky Looter is one of five. Okay. Right. No, let's continue on this tree. So, sales manager and mercenary. Let's go for both of those. And let's hope that we get lucky with digging. Okay, so like a complete idiot, I didn't bring any um, repair kits with me, so my shovel has broken. So, that's gone well for me, unfortunately. And what we do have is the second trader I found just up the road. So, I'm going to go ahead to that and see what we can find and sell some of the stuff on us. And then head home, because we've completely wasted our day here. Well, pretty much. Unfortunately, used up all our stamina for nothing. But at least we've started digging the hole, so it's not all bad, I suppose. And I've got no food that I can eat on me, so let's just get to the trader. Sell some of the stuff on me. Or well, sell as much stuff as we can on me. And head home. Okay, so it was this trader that I didn't get the ammunition crates at, which is good because hopefully we get some lovely ammo and weapon mod. The flashlight, the sorry, the weapon mod for the weapon flashlight. Hey, be quick about yeah, your that business. thing I just picked up. I'm probably gonna sell 56 stooks. That sells pretty well. I'm gonna scrap you. Um, yeah, I can't sell you. Probably can sell multiple of you. I can't sell any of you, which is fine. Sell all of you. Sell the can. Can't sell you. The clay. I'm selling bulks of 150 for four dukes. Better than nothing, I suppose. Better than nothing. The bones, he doesn't want. So we obviously don't have enough of those. The animal fat, yeah, we'll sell those. The cowboy hats, yeah, we'll sell it. Okay, so what has this guy got? Uh, concrete mix, we may buy that, and the cobblestone rocks, we probably will buy that. Rebar frames could be handy. Uh, level 5 stun baton. An entire blade trap. Ooh, the munitions box is good for... Ah, storage box. He only has one, but I'm going to buy it. Why not? And... Anything else? Jars of honey. Ski goggles, mining helmets. Weapon flashlight mod. Military glove. Night Stalker. Uh, sneak 5% better at night. Contact grenades, forge. Uh, electrical fence posts. Compound crossbow. 
No, we're good on that at the moment. Night Stalker Volume 3. Uh, blade weapons do 10% more damage at night. That's pretty good. And learn how to craft metal chain modifications and increase your stock in wheelchair business. And steel armor. Oh wow, still more. Uh, we can't afford that, unfortunately. We can afford the military gloves, though. Well, let's go back here. Concrete. We're not going to be able to buy... Yeah, we can't buy all of that. Barely buy half of it. Yeah, let's get that. Because this I can kind of find. So that's easy enough. Well, good yeah, we've got some that. more concrete. That's not so bad. And I've emptied that. And I've probably sorted everything else out here. Yeah. Okay, well, no repair kits. We've got some more concrete. So overall, that's not so bad. Okay, so... Uh, still armor schematic. I am. Um, someone asked in a stream that I was watching if it does exist. Uh, I think it was Cage eight four eight. Um, yes, it does exist because I've just found one and two lock picks as well. So I still think trash is the best thing to search ever in this in Alpha eighteen because you can get so much from it. Which is awesome. Sadly, um, I can't make it because I'm not allowed to in my la in my playthrough at the moment. I will do a normal. Well, actually, I, I am doing a normal one in my stream series. That is a normal one. There's no mods, no challenges. It's just me versus the zombies, and you know the zombies sometimes kick my ass, but most of the time. I'm kicking their asses. So, it's all good. Oh, I'm out of stamina. Kind of wish I could get a vehicle, though, in this. <laughs> I still can't believe that I bought the goddamn 4x4 truck accessories. What was I thinking? Never mind. It is what it is. And... Well, that's the end of that, basically. Let's go in my new back door, because I felt like making myself one. And most of this can go in here. That can't. And that can go upstairs. And the snow, that doesn't sell. And that I'm going to keep, see if we can get more of it and see what... See if it sells then. That I'm going to scrap. And again, yeah, most of this goes upstairs. I can't read that because, you know, I still haven't completed one treasure mission yet. And that can go in there. Okay, this is kind of a God knows what chest, but I'm working on it. I'm slowly getting there. So let's place down my chest and give myself somewhere to actually store things in safety. That's the next thing to do. That's it. It's a shame there's only one. What can I actually turn it into? A chair? Okay, that's really random stuff. A doghouse? Okay, well, it's going to stay as this. And yeah, it's going to stay here. Does that mean I can pick it up as well? No, I can't pick it up. Once I put it down, that's it. Interesting. Well, let's get all of this stuff upstairs. This is going to encumber me quite badly. Yeah, that's fine. What I can also do is just, you know, nerd pole up for quick easiness. Oh, the speeds. Never mind. Um, well, they're starting to. S well, yeah, no, sorry. Let's get rid of those. In fact, I haven't found any more glass blocks recently since an update. 
So that's fine. We're keeping those. We're keeping those and those. And yeah. Keep those on. I know it's a big stack. And let's put everything away in here for the moment. I think I don't think that sells. So we'll get rid of that. Uh, I don't think they sell, but they might do. So we'll keep hold of that for the moment. Okay, well, I think that's it. This video, we haven't really got much done, unfortunately. But that's well. To be fair, I got the base sorted out, so that's not too much of a problem. It's more... Okay, yeah, this chest is now getting full. So let's take that out. It's not really a chest. It's a working tool stiffy box that I've commandeered. Right, we're down to two repair kits. That's not such a good thing. And all of that can go around here. At least we have everything being in one place. It's not such a bad thing anymore. There we go. And yeah, let's just finish this off. But anyway, yes, we've not done too much. We failed our mission because you know I forgot to bring repair kits. So that sucks. But overall. We've got our base ready for Horde Knights. Kind of. I know it's not the best looking Horde base. But for the moment it'll do. And that can go in there as well. Um, but yeah, it's a simple plan. But hopefully it'll be an effective plan. I might even... put a little bit out there that I can jump to and that way I can shoot down there easier and I've got to take this bit off so let's do that now but yes yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video if you did remember to hit the like button and if you want to see how badly this place holds up against the hordes remember to hit the subscribe button but until next time have fun and enjoy the rest of your day